For today's project, we're gonna make a dragonfly from my book. And all you're gonna need for this one is four butter knives. Now, if you wanna hang it up, you can use a flat washer, or I've been able to use small pieces of filler rod that we can bend and hook over into a little loop. So then we can hang it up on the wall when we're done. So I've got my four butter knives, and if the handle of the butter knife is nice and fancy, like you see this one here is, I like how it's got a head shape and it's a little bit decorative, you're gonna use the handle and then four of the, the buttering ends. And the way you do that is two are gonna get cut, you're gonna mark them here at the base of the blade, and you're gonna mark two more about an inch and a half, inch, inch and a half up from the base. You wanna stay consistent, I don't like the ends, they're not fancy enough for me. Look at me getting bougie over silverware. So I'm gonna take this fork I used for some other stuff. I like that it's got almost a head shape. And I'm gonna take this and I'm just gonna cut it at the base. I'm gonna mark this with the white paint pen. I'm gonna clamp all these and I'm gonna cut them where I've marked them. We're gonna save the four blades and we're gonna need a body. So if you like the ends of your, if you like the handle end, save one handle end and the four blades or find you another one that is sexy like that. All right, now that we have the wings and the body cut, we have burrs on the edges. Each time you cut, you're gonna have a burr on the edge, and the way to fix that is they need to be cleaned up. The way to fix that is, I've got a two inch 60 grit blending disc. These are made by Weiler Abrasives. They just get twisted on, and you're gonna take your piece, and you're gonna go at an angle, so we can get you here at an angle and we're gonna clean that burr off. Now that we have all the pieces to bird, we're gonna take the body and lay it upside down on the workbench. We're gonna take the two longer knife blades and we're gonna put them towards the head and we're gonna angle them forward slightly. The two shorter knife blades are gonna be directly behind it, angled backwards slightly. You're gonna take your welder, whether you use a MIG or a TIG, and you're gonna weld the two together on the body and the back. We're gonna weld the two together on the body at the front, and then we're gonna weld a small weld on either side here and here. If you want to hang your dragonfly on the wall, you can take a small washer like this, hold it up at an angle, and just give it a tack weld back here, and that'll give you a place to hang it. Once you're done welding your project, you're going to want to take a wire brush, and you're going to want to clean up any discoloration, and you're going to want to take a hammer and a chisel, and you want to chip any weld spanner that's in the project so that no one gets cut when they are holding on to it. There you go, y'all. A really easy project that you could do that's right from my book. If you're looking for the project, first person to go over to my Etsy shop and buy the book, you're going to get that one for free. I am just going to send that to y'all. So if you're looking for the book, Etsy.com slash shop slash Barbie the Welder and you can go get yourself your very own projects if you don't want to wait for more of my videos. If you want more videos, make sure you're subscribed to my channel Barbie the Welder here on YouTube so that you can get all of them because eventually if y'all will stick around every Monday I am posting a new project. So have fun, happy welding.